troop commander kindly give the troops the tickets pahinga. Uh, Interior and Local Government Office in Charge under Secretary Eduardo Año, who will be a regular secretary of the department after one year. I know because I didn't appoint a good secretary. I don't know, but that is the only law available. Na nakita ko na military members have to wait for one year before they can be appointed as regulars in the other branches of government. Pero kita mo naman lahat ng military nagtatrabaho ole after their active service. Presidential Advisor on Military Affairs under Secretary Arthur Tabaquero. AFP Chief of Staff General Carlito Galvez. Brigadier General Divino Ray Pabayo, Commander Joint Task Force Sulu. The officers and enlisted personnel of the Joint Task Force of Sulu. Uh, basahin ko na lang. I'm not into reading speeches, but uh, it's sunset time para makasave ako ng oras. Punta lang ako dito dahil uh, maraming nasugatan. And uh, alam mo na, uh, Commander-in-Chief ka. Hindi mo minsan matiis na masama ang loob mo. Kaya pumunta lang ako dito pag konsuelo para salir sarili ko na masabi ko na uh, nag nagampanan ko ang trabaho ko. To be with my soldiers and policemen during their hour of pain and grief. I stand here today as your Commander-in-Chief to remind you of your sworn duty to defend this nation and protect the people. You are here today for one reason only, because you have answered the call to maintain peace and to ensure safe communities for every Filipino. The growth of the Philippines, especially Mindanao, has always been hindered by insurgency and terrorism. I therefore commend the Joint Task Force Sulu for your relentless efforts against various threats, groups in your area of operation, especially the Abu Sayyaf. Alam mo, ang Mindanao holds the promise kasi dito walang bagyo. Kung meron man, yung mga baha, but because of the heavy precipitation, tubig. But wala dito ang bagyo in the sense na maraming nasisira ng bahay, hangin and everything. And Mindanao promises to be uh, our food supplier. Dito sa Mindanao, Na, napunta na ako, napunta rin kayo ng Luzon. Paglabas mo ng kabanatuan, nagmotor lang ako, umikot ako ng sunon sa itaas, uh, na iso pagudpod. Alam mo, every three minutes uh, or four ang kasalubong mo. Dito sa Mindanao, everywhere, movement dito because of uh, the development. Sana lang para sa ating mga kababayan, kapatid, pinsan, na makapagtrabaho kung nandito sa Mindanao. If they are outside, they can benefit in the economy because that is the only reason where we can be really say na nagawa natin ang trabaho natin. Ina trabaho ninyo, pusta, huwag na tayo magbulahan. Tra trabaho ng sundalo, pusta buhay talaga. But uh, the country remembers you. I personally uh, would like to, I said, to uh, give my police attention. And lahat ng kailangan ninyo from the time you enter the service up to the time, uh, may, may, may plano na ako. Uh, 
asimato pa ko na nating taguin but just ponder on it tonight tulugan mo lahat ng mga asawa na militare o police na alam mo na uma hindi umabot sa panahon uh, yung mga asawa ninyo may trabaho and I take care of your education sa mga anak wala kayong problema dyan and as a matter of fact uh, post Marawi I left to Lorenzana and uh, General Macario 500 million for your intervention karamihan ng sun mga generals ninyo nandiyan sa akin nagtatrabaho. As a matter of fact, the cabinet, yung cabinet ko, dalawa, tatlo na lang kaming bisaya na iwan dyan. Puro Ilocano yan, puro kaibigan ko, puro dumaan ng Mindanao at mga kilala ko. Sila, sila yung si Mato, Anyo, at alam mo kung bakit, wala akong ano sa mga civilian. Ang mga civilian, tamad, takot, at yan yung transaksyon. Uh, si Eduardo del Rosario, tinawang lanaw, sinabi ko, bigyan mo ako bahay na 100 houses in two months. Ano yan? Saka maganda. Kaya wala akong ano, except that ang gusto ko kasi sa inyo, pag inutos sana, gawain mo yan at gagawin at walang sindikato. Kaya kaming mga presidente, si Gloria, pati, umaasa sa military. Kasi sa military, kasi isang salita, isang honor, walang lukuhan. Yan. I assure you that I, you have my full support as you conduct intensive military operations against these terrorist groups, particularly those who subscribe to the extremist ideologies of the Islamic State and Al-Qaeda. This is just a bankrupt, inutile na ideology. Ang alam na nito, magpatay, pati magsira, destroy and kill. So, may order to you, destroy and kill also. Bakit kung palugi, Bong yung, lahat ba kayo may ano na? September, September, October, sir. Ilan na sila? Bali sila yung nakatakatak na sir, may nasa na mga more or less mga 5,000. 5,000 sir. 5,000 sir. Uh, I-deliver sa nila sa yung 50,000 at saka natin 50,000 sir. Then 5,000 every month sir. Yung, yung arm score sir, every, every, every month, month 5,000. Unahin sir dito sa... Kasi si Bong, hindi ako nagbibiro ha? Hindi ako nagpapatawa. Pagbalik o sunod dito, hindi pa nakumplete ito sila. Yung baril mo, ibigay mo sa kanila. Wala ka magtawa-tawa dyan, ibigay mo dyan sa kanila. By being here, you are also honoring the sacrifices made by your comrades, particularly the 22 soldiers who have been wounded during the recent encounter in Patikon. We are grateful for your heroism, and I will personally ensure that you will be taken care of as you recover from your injury. Our progress as a nation. can never be realized until there are elements that continue to prevent us from achieving lasting peace. I offer you only two choices. Return to the faults of the law or face the full force of our government. To our troops, I know that you have worked hard throughout your careers and there have been moments when the fight seemed difficult. Yet, in the spirit of selfless service, you remain determined to carry on with your mission despite the challenges you face in the field. The least that I can do, kay Presidente ninyo, pupunta ako dito. 
Yan na lang ang magawa ako. Hindi naman ako makaistambay na matagal kasi napaka-busy ko. But every time that you need me, and everything that you need to survive, ibibigay ko. Wala kayong hiningi yung mga higher command na hindi ko binigay. Ako lang naman, I don't know, baka bastos pakinggan ninyo. Ako lang yung presidente na nagbibigay ng sidearm. Kasi lalo na dito, gira dito, baboyan eh. Do not surrender. Kaya ako binigyan ko kayo ng that's one magazine deployed another two. Pag naubos yung dalawa, yung last magazine, iyo yan. Huwag kang huwag kang pumayag na kunin sa iyo buhay yung baril mo. At kung makorner ka, wala ka ng bala, huwag kang magpahuli. Dadalahin ka ng kampo, gawain kang aso doon, at pagkatapos, iharap ka sa kamera, luglugin ka. Kaya, buong, yung sabi ko, pag wala pa yan, sunod balik ko dito, yung baril mo, pati yung baril lahat ng sekretary, eh, kunin mo yung kuliktahin mo. Yan naman nila kailangan niya. Pero yung sabi ko, huwag kayo magpababoy. Ang sundalo ko, matapang at handang mamatay. Kaya pag wala ka ng bala, yung last magasin, kainin mo na lang. Kasi kung ako, for one reason or another, mag-abigyan ng plano, mag-landing ako, hindi nila ako mahuling buhay. Pasabugin ko itong muka ako sa harap nila. Please know that I am very humbled by your dedication, inspired by your resilience, and thankful for your continued support. With your bravery, selflessness, and patriotism, I am optimistic that we will one day defeat all threats to democratic institutions and secure a brighter future for our beloved country. All I can say with pride, you are not alone in this fight. The Filipino people stands beside you, and I stand with you every step of the way as we advance the common good and promote the safety of our nation. As we move forward, I ask all of you to remain committed to being a soldier and as we pursue our shared task of building stronger and more peaceful Philippines. Mabuhay ang sundalong Pilipino! Ah, hindi man sila sumali. Kayo magpakpak niya mga sibilyan. Mabuhay ang sundalo! Mabuhay! Kayo dyan. Mabuhay ang sundalo! Pilipino. Ayan. Medyo... Uh, again, uh, to take off ako. Baka matamaan pa rin ang 50 caliber dyan. Wala na. No more. Para sabi ko, hindi mo ako mapuhuli na... Kakainin ko itong 9mm ko. Uh, I pray that you, for your safety, I ask God that uh, bigyan kayo ng protection, makauwi sa pamilya ninyo uh, every now and then. Uh, let me just uh, give me time to complete the deliveries of the... Nauna yung ano, pati may award lahat. Ako yung nag-insist na lahat ng... Sundalo, basta matamaan uh, ng bala o srapnel, bigyan talaga medalya. So I created the order of Lapu-Lapu. Uh, na matunok ka lang So dapat talaga may, ano, may award. Sige, at uh, ingat lang. Hanggang kaya, ingat lang. Do not play extraordinary hero. Cover ng cover. Huwag naman yung wala ka ng sa sine lang yan. Dito, every step of the way, ensure that your safety first. Then you kill. Para wala na. 
Pabalik-balik rin na. Just with the NPAs, may puro mayabang. Kala mo naman, pati ako tinatakot ng ulol. Yung siso na ito, kumatos daw ako. <laughs> ulol. Wala namang Navy, walang Army, walang helikopter, walang ang kapgo, walang Air Force. Tapos kung magsilita, kala mo sino? Wala ka niya. Yan ambos-ambos lang. But next time around, we will uh, raise the, the bar higher. Sabi ko, pag magdating ang pangulaan ng surrender, surrender. Pahit ka dyan hanggang mamatay ka. Hindi na itong accept ng surrender, pabalik-balik kayo. Well, anyway, I, I hope that uh, you, uh, you would be well and I intend to come back here somewhere. May, ngayon lang kasi marami akong sundalong tinamaan. I have to go because I have to go back to maabutan ako ng dilim, sunset, limitation. Thank you and mabuhay ang sundalong Pilipino. Thank you very much, President Rodrigo Roa Duterte. The man